Being a Michigan State volleyball player has meant so much to me. It's truly a privilege to play for this team and to play for this coaching staff. And I thank Kathy George so much for taking that chance on me. And she wants us to be the best versions of ourselves. Every single time you come into the gym, no matter that be like a lift or a practice or a film session, like you're there to get better. I've seen so much progress just went from when I came last spring and just as far as chemistry and camaraderie between the players of the team, I feel like we're just such a closer unit and everybody's working towards kind of the same goal and the same ideas. So I've seen a huge amount of growth and it's been awesome. We worked a lot on culture this year and chemistry and getting to know each other at a deep level outside of volleyball. And I think that's really helped with our relationships on the court and off the court. And doing so, I've been able to get a deep understanding and relationship with each girl. And there's been times on teams where I, maybe I want to be as close with someone as I would with other people, but I can't say that about this team. And I just, I love them so much. I, I can't imagine doing life without them, to be honest. <laughs> I think one of the main reasons I came to Michigan State was for Kathy George. I mean, she's a legend in the sport, she's a great coach, just a great female role model for her players and um, for the sport itself. And she's just a strong woman and I love being around her. I did struggle like believing in myself a lot at the beginning and that's always hard being an athlete is wondering if you can do it. But again, like my teammates and my coaches, they instilled that confidence in me. Kathy would always say to me, you know, I recruited you for a reason. I didn't just put you on this team to put you on this team. And I just think like having that confidence and knowing my teammates always believe in me and my coaches believe in me, like that helped me believe in myself. And so that just opened many doors for me to just to continue to keep working and to continue to keep pushing and getting better. And I knew that if I just stayed that with that process, like I would find my way on the court and good things would happen. The coaching staff is a big reason why I came here. They have helped me develop as not only a player, but as a person as well off the court. If I needed help, if I was experiencing some tough times, they were always there to help me. I can thank them all I want for helping me on the court and developing these skills that I was able to develop, but I think I need to thank them more for being there for me for the past four years off the court as well. I think my first home game here at Jenison and first Big Ten kind of home game, I just, it was really cool for me to have that atmosphere and um, play at home here. That was probably my favorite night. My favorite moment uh, of being a Michigan State volleyball player was definitely going on our Elite Eight run in the tournament my sophomore year. That was something extremely special to experience, just being in that position and like in that environment. Um, that was something that I'll never forget. And that team was definitely something special. They just left so much of a legacy that, you know, I was really like wanting to carry on my last two years and into my senior year as well. I think nothing will beat the Elite Eight. I was able to be a part of that team and we have so many memories from the Elite Eight, Sweet 16, and all the adversities that we overcame together. They, we still cherish those to this day. I'm a little nervous, not gonna lie, but being on the court for the last time is something I've been dreading since I was a freshman, and it kind of just hit me like a bus this year, but I'm excited to do one last go around with these girls. I'm really happy that this is the group that I got to spend my last year with. Every time I'm with my teammates and the coaching staff and we're all together and we're having fun and laughing, like I just keep thinking I'm gonna miss these moments so much and I'm gonna miss the people and I'm gonna miss the relationships and yeah, I'm gonna miss like competing with them every single day. I don't wanna leave the girls. <laughs> I love them so much and I have such a deep relationship with every single one of them. It's gonna be hard to see them continuing on the court, off the court without me. And I'm so extremely thankful for this team for welcoming me last spring and for just being the greatest friends and um, for building that relationship for lifelong friendships.
the people here at Michigan State have meant so much to me and like the community here and everyone always talks about the Spartan family and everyone hears that all the time but it's such a real thing and it's something that'll never leave you and it's gonna be so cool like years down when I you know I can tell my kids that I was a Michigan State volleyball player and that's something that I'll, that I'll have with me forever and those memories will you know stay with me forever. Mostly just being grateful for the experiences that I've had and then kind of excited for the future too as it's coming to an end in college volleyball. I'm excited to see what's going to happen next and continue hopefully my volleyball career. I'm going to miss it. <laughs> That's all I can say. I, was, I don't know if I can let go so quickly, but you know I have to and I'm definitely going to miss it. <laughs>